Hello Namaskar, my name is Pradeep Pradhan. Today I am going to explain you about the procedure of IV cannulation. Uh, it's step one, gather all liquids like RH cannula dressing, alcohol swab, free fill saline floss, gauge, toniquids, appropriate size of cannula, extension and gloves. Then wash your hands and wear disposable gloves and apron. And in the next step, apply toniquids and find a accessible vein. And after finding accessible vein, then clean the site by using alcohol swab for 30 seconds. Then allow the area to dry. In the meantime, you can change your gloves. So remove the gloves and do hand drop and again put another sterile gloves. In the next steps, prepare the cannula. That is, check the proper movement of introduce needles and mix plant the wounds of IV cannula. Next, stretch your skin by using your non dominant hands and at the dominant sense, hold the IV cannula. Just like Pisa, that is, place your forefinger and ring finger over the wings of IV cannula and put your thumbs at the back of inlet of IV cannula. At the next step, insert the introduced needle at 10 to 30 degree angle and observe flashback. When blood flashback at the inlet of the IV cannula, then again not advance the introduced needles because it may lead to a rupture of a vein. So, we throw the introduced needles and advance the IV cannula into vein. At the next step, floss the catheter properly by using pre saline floss and attach extension. After then, uh, secure the IV cannula by using cannula dressing or IV 3000s. After proper fixation of dressing, make sure apply label. Okay, this is all about the procedure of IV cannula. It is not so difficult, it needs uh, the proper skin preparations, then prepare the IV cannula, then insert the uh, needle at the 10 to 30 degree angles and when the blood press, then simply withdraw the introduced needles and advance the cannula. Then by using people's saline floss, properly floss the catheter and secure IV cannula. Okay, thank you for watching this video.